I recently made a video about Microsoft's privacy policies. The reason I ended up going down that rabbit hole is because I had just started using OneDrive, which is one of Microsoft's cloud services. One of the things I didn't know when I first started using OneDrive was that it automatically syncs itself to your desktop. So for a while, I couldn't figure out why all of my files kept ending up in folders on my OneDrive rather than on my laptop or computer. This felt incredibly creepy and was very annoying. I'm clearly not alone on this. There are numerous posts littered across the internet from people complaining about similar problems. Since I was using OneDrive as a way to share and transfer files, some of the folders on my devices were essentially identical to the ones on my OneDrive, which caused a lot of confusion. Eventually, I noticed that Microsoft was being sneaky by presenting itself through OneDrive automatically as the save destination whenever I needed to save anything. Rather than just serving as a tool for specific purposes, OneDrive was actively trying to become my desktop. I realized that if I wanted to save anything to my own devices, I would have to manually navigate the save destination away from OneDrive every single time. At one point, I discovered that a bunch of software had been installed on OneDrive, which meant that I had to delete and reinstall everything all over again, making sure to confirm the save destination every step of the way. Beyond being massively creepy, this was severely irritating because I was never given any notice and I never consented. In my case, OneDrive had one job, which was to help me share files between devices. I had exactly zero intention of copying and pasting all of my personal projects and programs into Microsoft's invasive web of privacy policies. If you happen to be using OneDrive and you don't want it to become your desktop, you can open up OneDrive settings, go to account, and then select choose folders. Once you've done this, you'll be able to deselect desktop. However, note that by doing this, you'll need to select and deselect individual folders for each of your devices accordingly. The other thing you'll want to do is go to the sync and backup tab and turn off save photos and screenshots. Then click on manage backup and turn off anything you don't want synced. In conclusion, this shit is fucked up. If you're currently using any of Microsoft's services and you feel like making an educated decision on whether or not you want Microsoft to have access to your information, documents, and data, check out my other video on Microsoft's privacy policies. I'll have it linked below. Like and subscribe if you want, and maybe I'll see you in the future.